sleeping, baby. hey guys welcome back to another video it is so good to have you here so as the title entails we are going to be using color mine lotion as a makeup primer and of course i'm going to be giving you a makeup look as well okay so i'm going in to prep the leads and as well clean my brows using la girl pro concealer in the shade fawn and Blossom Cosmetic Concealer in the shade 05 and we'll be doing brows later. Welcome to my channel. In case this is your first time here, you're so very welcome. And if you're a returning subscriber, you're so welcome as well. Please make sure to subscribe to the channel and give the video a thumbs up. And let me know your thoughts down in the comments section. So after setting the brow bone area, I'll be going in with a Flawless 60 color eyeshadow palette from Flawless Ivy Cosmetics and I'll be going in with the brown, the green shade, pardon me, and I'll be placing that at the outer corner going to the inner corners of the eyes. And please make sure to tap the product on before blending and also ignore my eye shape, I'm actually having eye issues right now so wearing the eyeshadows will not look like so encouraging that's why i try to use models on my channel as well to teach so i'm going with a bit of fluffy blush just a brush just to soften out the edges and i'm going in with this pink shade and a more for fluffier brush to blend the outer corners of the green to make to get a smooth transition as well Please also make sure to blend. Blending is key. I can't keep all the footage here else it's going to be so long and boring but just make sure to blend. Now after blending I'm going back in with that green just to reinforce in case if I lost um, any green around that blending period. I'll be going in with the black just to darken the outer corner just a little bit. So I'm going to go in with this goldish shimmer and just placing that in the inner corners of the eyes just to brighten and I'll be going in with a light green shimmer and tapping it on the dark shimmer just for a shine. So I'll be going back in to blend the outer corners one more time and going in with eyeliner i'm using a gel eyeliner from it has no name on it so i'll just be creating like a wing liner and after that we're going to be going into the skin okay so now onto the most part I'm going to be using the mocha color mine lotion and i'm going to be using a foundation brush to apply and I'll be letting it sit for a few minutes until it dries down because you don't want to apply your foundation wet. So after applying, I'm going to let it sit for a few minutes. Okay guys, so this is what we're looking like right now after it's dried down and we'll be going in with foundation. And for foundation, I'm using the Blossom Cosmetics foundation in the shade 03 and 05. And I'll be using a Dumb Beauty blender to apply and blend it in. And to get the most coverage, I'm going to be building up the foundation as I did not color correct. So anywhere I see that I need more coverage, I'm going to go back in and reapply as you would see in the video. Please, if you've got questions and suggestions, kindly leave them down in the comment section and I'd love to hear from you guys. If you'll be trying to use Calamine Lotion as a primer, that is if you have oily skin. So let me know your thoughts down in the comment section. And also remember to blend the sides of your nose and your neck 
area as well. Okay, so after that is blended in very very well, I'll be going in with concealer and I'm using Elegal Pro Concealer in the shade Fawn to highlight these areas. And I'll be cleaning the edges of the shadows as well to create that to help clean up maybe underneath the wing. Now while that is sitting, I'll be going in with the concealer for the contour and this concealer is from Blossom Cosmetics as well in the shade 07 and I'm going to be using that to contour my forehead, the cheekbone area and my jawline now I'll be blending the concealer and please make sure to tap 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 don't drag your beauty blender or your brush around tap the product in and blend as you go Okay, so I'll be blending the contour around my nose with a fluffy brush and for the face contour blend, I'm going to be using a damn beauty blender as well and I'm going to be blending upwards so as to create that snatched cheekbones that I want. So try to blend your contour upwards instead of downwards so it doesn't drag your face or make your face looking down if that makes sense. So I'll be blending that out and in and I'll be going back in with the foundation beauty blender I use just to make sure everything goes seamless and I'm not having harsh lines. Reinforcing the green on the bottom um, area of the eye and that's well on top and I'll be setting the areas which I highlighted with the Iman pressed powder. And I'm just going to be placing that around. Now I'll be going in with the brown from the Flawless IV to set the nose contour as well as all other areas which I place the contour and I'll also be reinforcing the greens, the shadows as I go. Now I'm reinforcing the, or I'm actually setting the contour rather. And I'll be going in with a bit of blusher just to apply around that area. And after that is blended out, be spraying down the face with a karite setting spray. And as you can see, my left hand is my <laughs> makeup pan, and they are looking it's looking somehow so ignore that part guys so i'm going to be pressing that in i'm going in to do my brows i'm using davies number three eyebrow pencil to fill in the brows lightly So I did go in with some falsies but my eyes were not just taking it so I had to take it off because of the eyes issues. We'll discuss that in the later video guys. So I'll be highlighting my brow bone and applying some inner liner and going in with some shimmers in the inner tear dots and just going back to reinforce the colors on the eyes. Now I'll be going in with a bit of mascara and I also did apply the mascara on the eyebrows just because I'm extra like that. So I'll be spraying the face down one last time and going in with highlighter to highlight these areas and after that is applied we'll be doing lips next. And the highlighter is from the Blossom Face Defining Kit as well. 
and gosh look at that skin y'all the glow is there so i'll be taking off the foundation and concealer of the lips i don't like to go back in with lipsticks on products i like to have the lips bare so i'll be lining with davis number no. three eyebrow pencil And after lining, I'll be going in with a peachy nude type of lipstick at the center and I'm going to be blending that out. After blending, I'm going to be spraying the face and the look is completed. Please let me know your thoughts down in the comment section and do well to check my description bar for the feedback on how long the color my lotion did hold. I love you guys and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!